Hey, this is Andrew Brown, and we are taking a look at version control systems, which are designed to track changes or revisions to code. And there's been a lot of software over the years that helped us do that. We had CVS, Subversion, Mercurial, and Git. So back uh, in 1990s when we got CVS, though even though we had it, I don't think a lot of companies were using it. It took some time to adopt. If you ever heard of like Doom or Wolfenstein, you'd be uh, interested to learn they didn't use version control systems. And what they would do is they would literally copy files onto floppies and hope that they don't lose their files. But of course, a version control systems makes it really easy to not worry about losing floppies or CDs or drives because they keep track of all the history. Then came Subversion in 2000, but the real game changer was in 2005 when we were introduced to a new type of version control system. And we had Mercurial and Git, um, but the key difference between the old ones and the new ones was the old ones were centralized and the new ones were decentralized. And these decentralized ones became very popular for very specific reasons. They had full local history and co uh, complete control of the repo locally. They were straightforward and efficient for branching and merging, which was a really big deal. Uh, better performance, improved fault tolerance, flexible workflows, worked fully offline. Um, and out of the two, Git was the one that won. And there are reasons for that. And we'll talk about that when we look at version control services. Um, but uh, yeah, Git is the one that everybody is using today. And that's why we are taking this course. I just want to point out, they're going to come across a lot of terms that sound like trees, tree, trunk, branches. Um, the reason for this is that version control represents um, uh, the revisions or changes in a graph-like structure. You can even say a DAG, um, if you're familiar with that. And so, uh, you know, you'll see these terms and we're not talking about real trees. We're talking about uh, the components of a version control. So there you go.